Iga is a legendary hero, holy element, cleric class, and comes from the ninja family, where this family provides a bonus chance to dodge and counterattack for each hero from the same family used. And Iga also has ether power, namely fiend resist, where Iga has immunity to new fiends for six turns. Judging from this initial assessment, we can see that Iga is a pretty good hero in defense. And judging from his base stats, Iga has quite high stats when compared to other ninja heroes especially in attack and vitality. And just like other ninja heroes, Iga doesn't have passive skills, which makes Iga look less good, even though he is a new hero. Combined with his mana charge, Iga will be quite good to use in defense formations. And judging from the skill effects, Iga has three skill effects, which if totaled, the skill effects will vary according to the number of charges. But let's just assume that he uses his third charge. So the first skill effect is summons a Kunai Fiend for all enemies. The Fiend damages the enemy with 450% attack every turn. Judging from the effect of the first skill, we can see that Iga is the strongest Fiend caster in the game, because he can deal very strong and deadly damage every turn. The second skill effect, the Kunai Fiend absorbs healing and disappears when it has absorbed health equal to 55% of its owner's max health, this effect is counted as a decent healing debuff. And the third effect, the Kanai Fiend explodes after three turns, dealing 2250 damage to its target. This effect is counted as extra damage, and the damage dealt is so strong that if combined with the damage from the first Fiend effect, it will be very possible for Iga to one-hit his enemies. Judging from the effect of his skill, we can see that Iga will be quite good to use in defense and attack formations, in tank and flank positions. And for the Titan attack team, Iga is not really recommended, because he doesn't have the required skill effects. And in raid tournaments, Iga will be quite good to use, especially in bloody battle tournaments. Overall, Iga is the strongest fiend hero to appear in empires and puzzles. This can be seen from the total damage he can deal to his enemies every turn, and also the explosive damage which is considered very deadly. You could say, there are only two ways to counter Iga's skills. The first is to use Fiend Destroyer heroes, such as Februus, Amidus, and Esme. However, if you don't have these heroes, you can use strong or fast healers such as Cleopatra, Blossom, and Daochan Costume. And you will be protected from the dangers of Iga's skills. And if there are no significant changes to Iga's skills during the beta process, then I can say that Iga would be a pretty good hero to have.